Hello YouTube, what is up? Today we have another review. This is a food review. As you can tell, we are trying the Dave's two quarter, two slash four, a quarter pounder basically. Two hamburger patties, and we're drinking some Coke. Anyways, so I took the fries out. So we had the bag. And here we have the hamburger in this very wrinkled burger bag. What? I guess they gave me the wrong burger. No, that's a single. Oh, there we go. There is double. So on this, you can see there is quite messy. It's quite messy. This cheese is runny and melted. Uh, on this, we have the tomato, the sauce, which is Thousand Island. The two patties and a bun, which looks like it's been mushed. So we're going to dig in. Oh. It's quite messy. Very flavorful. Very juicy. So the meat itself is actually very juicy. It's not like most fast food joints where their hamburgers are dry overcooked and tastes like their leftovers reheated. These burgers are pretty damn good. What am I gonna do without all these damn pickles? So Um, it's actually quite good. Uh, you know, it's got a very moist texture. It's not like McDonald's where you get the burgers, they're dry and overcooked. <clears throat> they taste, like I said, they taste like leftovers. This tastes like it's real and fresh. You know, it's like not frozen as they claim on the commercials. This does not taste like it's frozen. But it tastes very cheesy. You taste a little bit of the secret sauce. You definitely taste the bread, but the meat itself is square, which is interesting, but it's very flavorful. You know, it's juicy. You get hints of like Thousand Island on there. Anyways, you know, when you eat the beef alone, it does taste quite a bit bland. Without the sauce and all the additives, you know, the secret sauce, the ketchup, it does taste quite a bit bland. Base more napkins. You know, it's not terrible. It's not like a, the best fast food out there. The fast food is not good in general. It's just like why it's called fast food. 
because it's fast. It's not meant to be cooked like a sit down meal. It's just supposed to be crappy and fast. It's a little bit salty. But I do, just as you get it in, so at first, At first, you get this very zesty flavor, you know, a little bit of mayonnaise taste, maybe Thousand Island, you get the cheesiness, and as you bite into it, you get more and more and more, and then as you get further in to about this much left, you get kind of a bland flavor. It doesn't taste very good, it tastes kind of dry, <clears throat> well not dry, but like tasteless, and just salty. I don't know, it's a little bit flavorless. But yeah, I'm gonna finish this off, give it a rating, and wrap this up. So, anywho, if you're trying to give this burger a rating, I'd give it a 9.7 out of 10. But you know, it's not terrible. It's just not soon. So, anyways. I'm sorry if I sniffle or grunt or groan. <laughs> throughout this video. Yes, yeah, it was a little bit longer of a review because, you know, I had to eat a burger. I also have french fries over here. There's no point in reviewing french fries. Maybe I'll do that over the day. Anyway, so if you enjoyed this, thank you. Comment, like, subscribe, do all that. Have a good day. Uh, don't forget to like this video. And peace. See you in the next one.